Report. When they break down the cell, what's your process after that? Personally, what do you do? Um, I like to key in on their tendencies, so uh, try to pay attention to the detail on you know which way to force them, what do they like to do, and so you know the little details I try to keep. Do you do that all in your head? Do you write notes? Or do you, what do you do? Uh, do it pretty much in my head, and then when we uh, do scouting practice. I try to, you know, that's when I, that's when I practice it. That's when I try to put my method to work. How do you feel you've done against Brock Motor in these two times? Uh, I feel like the first time I was um, pretty successful with what our, what the coaches wanted me to do against them. Um, second time, I feel like I did a fair job. Um, we still got some easy clutches that I don't think he got the first time I messed against him. So. I would say last time was a fair job. What's important in trying to defend him? Just don't let him catch the ball. That's, I mean, that's the, the object. That's the way to make it hard for him. Just you know, make it uncomfortable. And so, uh, like I said, he's a, he's a great offensive player. You know, you see, he can go for 30s. So the biggest thing is just not let him get comfortable. Don't let him get going for one. What was he able to do in the second half of that last game? He, he was a little more, that was probably his most efficient half of the four halves against you. Um, he got to the line. Um, shot free throws. He got some easy layups. I just feel like, you know, like I said, he catch the ball, some backdoor cuts. He got some easy baskets. I feel like that's just what it was. Did they change the way they're trying to free him up at all? Have you seen them vary that since you've been guarding him, or they kind of run that those same sets? I feel like it was kind of the same. They're still running the same. I mean, actually, they ran a lot more sets, but I don't know. Um, I mean, I feel like they're still keen on trying to get him the ball. But uh, other players were making plays. Other players around were making plays. So uh, I feel like they were kind of letting them go a little bit more. You obviously saw that Brock went for 31 in his last game. You're aware of what Washington State has done over their last few games. What are you seeing different from them than, than what they were doing earlier this year? Uh, well, I haven't, I haven't been able to watch the game, but from what I heard, uh, I mean, he's gone off. Like I said, the players around him have shown that they can go off. So uh, I mean, it's like they're, they're kind of bouncing themselves out as far as scoring. I can't say what they're doing differently now. The uh, focus of the team as it heads to Vegas is what? Win the tournament. One game at a time, but our goal overall is to win the tournament. But one game at a time. How much does the rivalry Washington-Washington State play into that first matchup? I think it's a big rivalry, uh, especially for the fans, you know, the bragging rights. But, uh, for us as well, I mean, we definitely like to get that win. The uh, way that you guys have played this year, though, just being so of um, inconsistent. Do you think that you guys can win this tournament? I do. I well, believe it. Because we've shown that we can play at that high level to, I feel like we've shown that we can compete against those, the top teams in our league. It's just a matter of us, you know, executing and getting it done, but I have all the confidence in the world.